Mickey, yeah, another good workout there for the lads. Um, what did you make of the performance overall? Yeah, a good, a good runner. Um, it's certainly for the, for the the first half, um, and then uh, we, we we're, we're taking care of people at the minute, um, which I think is, is pretty obvious to everybody. But we uh, we're having to make sure that we manage the minutes properly and, and don't pick up any more uh, injuries because. We, we we don't have what we would call a massive squad of, of game ready um, league players but it was still good to see them sort of getting together and, and I think that for the first sort of half to, to ten minutes into the, the, the sort of second half to, to we started making the subs I think that we, we could see how we're wanting to play um, but it was always going to be obvious to us that when you make that many changes and um, that, that it becomes a wee bit disjointed, but it was it was a good workout for us, and it was it was um, it was good to get back to Brenton Park. We've still got work to, to do, but we I, I certainly seen signs of of how we want to get going. We uh, with the players that, that that we have here, but the important thing is is we manage the minutes properly, and we do, we don't pick up any more injuries. Um, and we just keep trying to add to the minutes, that's, that's what it was all about. I think it's, you've seen a lot of the positive signs, especially in that goal, which goal really well worked, and a lot of the, the things you probably have worked on already. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we 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 had a back three again that was completely different, so that, that all credit to them for, for, I mean, we've only just met um, the big lad Baba yesterday, so he's come into there. Um, we, uh, who else do we have in there? Who was the back three? Uh, ben and uh, Jameson. Jameson, there. Jameson um, hasn't um, been here or, or played for us since Preston. So he's just come into it as well. So I'll we'll credit to them for the way that they, that they, they attacked that. But we need to, to get some sort of consistency in there to, to try and keep moving it forward. But we're getting, we're, we're getting there. And, there was a lot of, like you say, a lot of stuff that we were pleased about, um, and a lot of stuff that we wanted to get better. But for for uh, good large parts of that first half, um, we 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 seen a lot of promising signs. You mentioned Jameson there. Can you tell us a bit about him and the addition to the squad? Yeah, we 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 obviously we were looking like we wanted to play with a back three. So the balance of that is is uh, trying to find a left footer who we, who we can see the qualities that that, that, that we need uh, there because we've got two flying wing backs who I'm really pleased with um, so we're, we're, we're pleased with that pleased with the midfield so it's just about trying to trying to fit the people in, into the right areas that we believe that we'll need during the season and the big man is is certainly one of the the, 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 the better defenders that I've seen for a long time with the stuff that we need to improve and we but that's what we'll try and do We'll work hard on trying to do that. Um, so it's it's just one of them. And like I say, a few changes, especially in that second half. But it is nice to see some of the younger lads, like it's Sam Taylor, has come through the college now. It's great yeah. to see them getting that back speed. Yeah, and then Arthur and, and all these kind of guys. It's important in the Hawking Hall and, and getting Mezer in there. I mean, Mezer's played left side, centre back, and we, we know he's not. But he, he he'll have a go at playing anywhere, and it was a wee bit of need to must it at that stage and then you get youngster Atlas and um, Reese on as well so we, 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 we give them all time and, and, and give them, try and introduce them a wee bit into the first team environment and, and play the print part in front of a bit of a crowd as well so it's important for their development as well that, that we give them the opportunities to, to, uh, to, to do that. Two more games left now in pre-season, Southport and Huddersfield. What are your aims to get out of those two games as it progresses? Yeah, just to, just to get nearer to being ready for the first game of the season. We, we would obviously like to try and stretch the time that we have the players on the pitch a wee bit more to get them closer to 90 minutes. But we have to balance that off because of the size of the group at the minute. And it keeps in the size of the group. I mean, the, 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 the what we would call probably first team ready um, players for us. That are, that are ready to go. So we're just trying to make sure that we don't get any more injuries. Kieran's got a serious injury. Um, we don't know, I don't like talking about how long people are going to be out, but that's looking, he's going to be out for a while. Um, so we've lost him. So we, do, we could just do without any more. 
we're working hard to try and bring more bodies into the building because we, we need that. I think when you've seen the, the types of changes that we made, I think we would have to be fair and say that the, 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 the players that we would like to be bringing off the, the bench were a wee bit more closer to being game ready. These boys, these boys that are coming off the bench probably need a wee bit more time um, training with us and, and playing development games in order to make that type of impact that that we need. But they, they'll get there in time because we we'll work hard with them. But we want to get boys in the middle of that, if you like, in terms of experience um, that can come on and hit the ground running for us. And we're, we're working hard to try and do that. Uh, and I expect to to hopefully get that done in, in, in the next day. Uh, certainly in the next week.